Hello everyone, let us learn the next case study. It is about the face mask which is uh, most trending now. So it is about how the face mask reduces the spread of respiratory droplet containing viruses. And now let us see how the question has been framed on this. Here the question says, a student designed a three layer mask on a paper as shown in the figure. PA cube P, A, Q, B, R, C and S, D are perpendicular to the line. So all these are perpendicular to this line A, D that is L. That means they are parallel to each other. So given here is A, B, 6, B, C, 9 and C, D, 12 cm. So from this we can calculate A, D is 27 cm over here. Then S, P is given the whole thing that is 36 cm. So we have to find out PQ, QR and RS and the question continues as it is. So let's get started with this information. We cannot uh, start with the sum. So we will require a triangle. I will join AS such that we will get two triangles that is ASD and PASA. So first one I will draw here uh, so that it will be clear for you. I will make it here X and Y. So this one triangle. One is here P S A. And I will take this one as Q X. Q X. One more triangle. This is A. This is X. And S, I have just neglected that Y part, V and D. So, I will be taking in triangle ASD, AX divided by AS, BPT, AB divided by BD. Why did we take this? Because BX is parallel to SD. We don't know AX by AS. I will take AB, we know it is 6 and AD is 27, the ratio here will be 2 by 9. 3, 2 times and 9 times. So now here in this triangle, in triangle PSA, instead of coming from this side, we will go because we know AX by AS here. AX by AS. So we will take PQ by SP. So we will take it here. AX, Y, AS. Why I took like that? Because we know the ratio of uh, AX by AS. So it will be PQ divided by SP. So this is 2 by 9. Then equal to PQ don't know. Divided by 36. So 2 into 36 divided by 9 will be PQ. Cancel 4. So PQ is equal to 4 into 2. 8 centimeters. So, PQ here is 8. Similarly, we will take the other triangle. Now, we need to find this QR here. QR. So, QR does not actually ha has any part of a triangle as such. We will take here like this. I will take PR divided by SP. Then, we will have to go for AY by AS. For that, we have to come down to the given data. That means AC divided by AD. So, here the triangle I will consider is A, D and this time I will be taking it as Y, C. So, we will take A, Y by A, S that is A, C divided by A, D. Now, we know what is A, C. A, C is 6 plus 9, 15 divided by A, D. AD is 27, cancel 3 5 times, 3 9 times. So I have taken AC divided by AD so that we go, can go up to AY by AS. So we get here AY divided by AS is equal to 5 divided by 9. Now we will go the other way, the other triangle that is here this way. S, A, P and this time I will take R. R, Y. So what do we get here? P, R by S, P is equal to A, Y by A, S. 
you can either refer this triangle the pull out triangle a y by a s here also check a y by a s p r by s p so p r by s p we don't know if p r p r divided by 36 is equal to this is 5 divided by 9 here so same thing again p r we will get it as 5 into 36 cross multiply here divided by 9 4 times so PR we will get it as 20 but they did not ask PR they asked us QR PR here is 20 this part this is we got 8 20 minus 8 QR will be 12 so QR here is 12 now we need to find next question is RS so RS is very easy to find out the whole thing is 36 then minus 20 see sp here is 36 from that we will cut off 20 so 36 minus 20 16 so here rs we get it as 16 now here ratio of pq pq is 8 qr is 12 4 2 times 3 times so option here is 2 is to 3 then next one qr is to rs qr is 12 and rs is 16 uh, 3 times and 4 times so 3 is to 4 